I think for, for Sandro, there's that instant feeling of, and you could see when he scored, the emotion coming out, big move, um, great start. And then I think the rest of his performance followed that goal, really, where he was, he was excellent. So I think now he'll hopefully feel the love of the supporters. There'll be an instant connection between him and them, and that can only help him. Behind the scenes, is he is he getting involved in the team spirit? There was um, at the start of the week there was a photo of him on social media, table booked in Weatherspoons for. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure that I'm sure I'm sure you wouldn't have missed <laughs> missed that. That looked like it had all the hallmarks of Matt Ritchie. Maybe I'm being unfair there, but um, I mean, is that I, I take it that's part of the, the sort of team morale but behind the scenes at the moment. Yeah, I'm not sure he was in there for team morale. I think he was in there for something to eat. So I think it was a, a very <laughs> a very innocent. Uh, situation, um, but obviously picked up by by you guys. I did hear about it, but I, no, he's he settled in really well, and he is part of the group. And as I said earlier, I think he he's built some really good friendships, and he's got some really good relationships, which is important. Certainly, when you go into a new dressing room, you want to find people that you can identify with and get along with, and that certainly helps settle you on the football pitch as well. He might end up going somewhere a bit nicer once he gets uh, his English lessons. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know how Matt Ritchie's got the blame for that. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm just putting two and two together and coming up with five. <laughs> Poor Matty. Yeah, no. I'm not sure he booked it for it. <laughs> um, on a more sort of serious note, I know it probably wasn't uh, serious, perhaps said by Jurgen Klopp at the weekend, but um, after their match last weekend, he said the new technical area rules, he said there's one club that it's it's going to affect more than, than others and it's going to be Newcastle. Um, did you see that? What did you make of those comments? I think I heard about them through various sources. Um, yeah, I think, I think the rules do impact us slightly more than, than other teams just because of how we've worked historically. And as I said, this hasn't been a new thing for me, Jason. This has been for, I've forgotten how many years I've been in management now, but for as long as I've been in management, that's how we've worked. So it's not something that we've just we've just done so um, I didn't find it too bad last week I have to say I think we as I said pre-game we <coughs> dovetailed in and out of the area it worked we talked I wouldn't have noticed necessarily a, a big change from previously 